Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. Today I'm going to be showing how to delete saved passwords on Google Chrome. So this can be very straightforward and basically what we're going to be going over is how to disable Google Chrome from not only offering if you want to save passwords on certain sites, but will also allow you to disable autofill for passwords as well as deleting passwords for specific websites. So this is going to be pretty much an all-in-one tutorial here. So I hope you guys enjoy. And we're going to start by actually heading over and opening up Google Chrome. I think that's a pretty logical first step we're going to take here. Up at the top right for the Customize and Control Google Chrome button, we're going to left click on it. And then we're going to go down this list until we get to settings and left click on it. Scroll down this list until you get to show advanced settings at the bottom of this page. Scroll down again. Underneath privacy and then underneath passwords and forms it says enable autofill to fill web forms in a single click. You can deselect this if you do not want autofill to appear and you can also uncheck this option to offer to save your web passwords and if you actually left click on this manage passwords hyperlink right here this will open up a window that will show all of the websites you've saved your passwords to right here, as well as websites you might have told Google Chrome to never offer to save your passwords from. If you did have any saved passwords here, you could just left click on the little X next to it, and that is a way you could delete individual saved passwords for specific websites. So, very straightforward. You don't have to click on save or anything other than if you're going to select done right here, but in terms of changing these two settings I do not believe you have to click on save or anything so very straightforward couple clicks and you should be done so I hope this brief tutorial helped you guys out and I will catch you in the next tutorial goodbye